explain to us in detail Hello, your Kurt, tibula hope you injury. Hope you having a fantastic day. Hope you had a good day at work as a barista. Hopefully we get to see a day in a life as Gremlin 0411 from Goals. I you, you know, I hope you understand, but like, I don't really want to go into too much detail, you know, that's like asking R9 to talk about his knee injury. That's like asking Kobe Bryant, well, no, not now, but about his Achilles injury. That's like asking Kevin Durant. I'm sick of the barista slander. Also about his Achilles injury. And it's like, all I remember, it was like a very cloudy day, man. There was like light drizzle in the morning. But by the time we got to game time, um, the rain had stopped. Um, you know, I stepped on the, on the pitch like, it, like it's another day. You know, I was obviously um, being heavily scouted at that time. I was 15 years of age, um, soon to be 16. And uh, yeah, the warm up went well, J just like always. You know, I always took my warm ups very seriously. You know, like um, always the ultimate professional. Um, and I was playing in the in the number six role, kind of like you know the biscuit position and stuff. And uh, highly recommended these kinds. The ball was like high up in the air. Penny. Um, and I was like already scanning my surroundings, like um, as always. I had to look left, right. I seen someone coming um, close to me, but I, f I had enough time to control it. The question was, how was I going to control the ball? Was it chest? Was it knee? Was it foot? I decided to go with the foot, which is very tough. I don't recommend it. But I was looking left. The ball's coming in the air. I controlled the ball, but the guy got really close to me. So I had to like almost react immediately after. So I went to do like a feint, just to try and like avoid, and poop, pop, 